Hello World Wide Web, I'm Dr. Shadow, the internet personality best hair, back on Faster Than Light, FTL. Haven't played this in four fucking ever, really needed something out right now because it's due in uh, 11 minutes, so it's not going to be up on time. Been uploading the other thing all night and I need a lot of sleep after drinking how many things of Mountain Dew Game Fuel. They're not paying me, so I can say whatever I want. Mango Heat Flavor, who the fuck thought that was a good idea? I don't really care for mango and it's got weirdly spicy thing to it. I'm like, what the hell is that? Is that ginger? Is that cayenne pepper? I can't tell. It burns. But I need to be awake, so fuck it. <laughs> anyway! I can't remember what the fuck. Post requires to all those frame it all. No, I remember how IQ to button the no play enable it. Okay, sounds good enough. So we're gonna go new game. Now, I. Since my hard drive crashed way back when, I don't have all my other ships. Easy. Increase scrap rewards, easier enemy generation. I never fucking did well in this game anyway. Advanced edition content. Yes. Oh boy. Ship list. Yeah, I know. I know. I don't I don't have any of the other ships that I unlock because they're just fucking not there anymore. Okay, so there's all the things I gotta... Uh... What the shit? That's a fucking tough thing to fucking do. Right. So we're going with that. Ah, uh, we got a crew. Uh... And gonna be the shadow and Cody and conspired ah, the conspired one. Back gonna have him now. Uh, customize it. Uh, conspired one. Yeah. I can only do human, it looks like, which is a shame. If I could have him an alien, that would have been better. Oh, man. Complete two for layout B and all that stuff. Oh, man. So I don't really got too much in terms of options right now, so... I just gotta remember how the fuck I'm supposed to... How the fuck I play this. And someone in the engine room is the oxygen room. There's shields, med bay, pause, doors, doors. Uh, and then there's security, like systems and shit. Pilot, captain. Okay. Start this. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for the journey, so make sure to explore each sect before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before the pursuing Rebel Fleet can catch up. Tip, Iron Weapons. Iron Weapons depower and lock a system for a time. If they hit the enemy shields, they deal their stun damage directly to the shield system. Continue. Okay, so we got Cody working the engines. We got the cons <laughs> in weapons. And Shadow, Captain Shadow. Pilot Shadow. Oh, we got nothing in the weapon system. One in the, sh the uh, engine. We got three unused reactor. Fucking boop. And a little bit more. With the engine. Not enough power, my ass. Oh, that's right. I need two to run the burst laser, so. I guess I want to be safe. I want to power the weapon systems in. Subsystems are fine. Open all doors, close all doors. There's the airlocks and shit. People tell me, yeah, open the fucking airlocks. That's a great way to make it so that you can actually not die from being on fire. Just don't have people in the way. But, okay. Ready for a jump. Where are we? 
Oh, yeah, that's where we're going. Okay, so. Exits that way. So this is just like. A shrap. Your senses have picked up a refugee ship drifting through the system? No doubt one of many fleeing the Rebel of Advance. It doesn't appear to have detected you. Or else, it's trying to avoid notice. I just hail the refugees, what's the worst that could happen? As you hail the refugee ship, a pirate ship jumps into the system and was using the refugee ship as bait! Damn it! I'm gonna, you're gonna, these fucking pirates are racist, I hate them. Let's kill them. Oh boy, uh... So, uh... Son of a bitch. How you fucking miss with the shit fucking shit? The shield's down there, ship is The pirate ship breaks apart and you salvage what you can. Contact the refugee ship. We got two nuclear lizards, one drone part, 14 spares. Ship. Thank you for your assistance, as you just do goodwill. And seeing how effectively you dispatch the enemy ship, they offer them what supplies they can spare. Uh, one missile, seven spares, and another drone. Okay, so let's fix this shit up. Cody, I'm go there. Uh, me, fix the shields. Oh, man. And we're all gonna have to get healed. Goddamn. Fucking doors could use some fixing. I think I'm doing worse than I ever did before. Uh, my health is fine. I just need to heal up Cody. Oxygen's getting good. We're fine. Okay. <sighs> Put the power back in the fucking weapons. Which, why? What first laser? Not bat with them. Uh, twenty spares for another. Oh. Dodge chances, dodge chances. It sounds really nice. Shields, shields, shields. That would be probably the best thing. There we go. So we got another shield bit. And we're going to have to get some... Engine parts to get it going. I could de depower the Artemis and put it in shields. Requires a system upgrade. Oh, that's fucking brilliant. Never mind. Can't do that. How do you. How do you where's the system up? Where's the system? Motherfuckers. Oh, well. We're moving on. Unvisited. Visited. Let's go straight. Jump to the next star. Big red is hot. You arrive at the beacon to find yourself dangerously close to a star. You, an automated rebel ship, impervious to the heat, moves in to engage. Ow! Ah. Ow. Explodes Lima has a substantial collection of useful scrap material. 
Okay, good. Now we gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh, great, great. Uh, Come on, come on, come on, we gotta get jump, we gotta jump, we gotta jump, we gotta jump, we gotta jump, jump, now. Distress beacon there, okay, go. You locate a nearby human mining colony where an unknown disease has spread virulently. They are setting up a quarantine to contain it, but a riot has broken out. Uh, we probably got medical systems. Hickory tries to keep the crowds in line, but the scene quickly turns ugly. Half crazed with fear, the infection grab infected grab mining tools and push back at your crew, forcing them to retreat hastily. You barely get away without injury. The same can't be said for the colony's leaders. You quickly leave. Well, it's a thought that counts. I mean, I, all I got was as much shit as I would have if I didn't do anything. Uh. Okay, adding that power part, does that give me that? Damaged. Well, that's great. Fix the fucking shield. Everybody, fix the fucking shield. How do you, what, 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 what system upgrade do I need? Someone let me know. God damn it. Put the oxygen in there, god damn it. Where's the oxygen in there? Yeah, just get the yeah, there we go. We got oxygen. So with that. Visit Nebula and Nebula here will make fleet pursuit slower, but will disrupt your senses. Or I could just go ah, uh, let's go around the nebula, fuck it. An automated rebel scout attacking a small refueling outpost. Alright, let's fucking take it out. What the fuck happened, man? Jesus! Well, we got him. Ship breaks apart and you quickly salvage what you can. Artemis missile. Drone part of that, not getting much shit. Outpost hails you after the scout was destroyed. Thanks for the help. We've been harassed non-stop by these scouts. Take this on the house. Yeah, a bit more. I'd like the missus, thank you, but fuck. Guys, can I buy some shit from you? Would that be nice? Just stick around in the weapons, and would that make it work any faster? And I don't necessarily need him in the engine room unless it's busted, do I? Or maybe it would be better to have him in the other room. I don't have any fucking idea. <sighs> I really need to watch videos of this fucking game to understand what the hell I'm doing. Spot a small rebel ship nearby. It seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. It does not seem to want to engage you in your ship. Yeah, let's demand it. Secure the cargo by forces. 
Looks like they don't want to fight, they're trying to escape. Take out the fucking engines. Fuck using another Artemis, just use the, sh the damn laser on this, I'm not in any real danger. Okay. Enemy FTL delayed, no problem. Oh, you buttfuckers. I just... It's okay, I was just trying to fucking stop you from moving and take your shit. Just trying to rob your ass in space. Distress. Someone might need my help. Let's go. You find a number of ships fleeing from a small space station, you hail them asking, What's wrong? Help! We're being overrun by some sort of giant alien spiders! Giant alien spiders are no joke, or fuck spiders? Giant alien spiders? Oh! Okay, I'll avoid Scott. Let's send him through. Your crew slowly creeps up on the cluster of the creatures from behind without warning the giant arachnids turn and charge! However, your team stays in control, and before long, you've beaten them back. They are thrilled with your success and offer you a reward. Fucking missiles, nice! Thanks. It's awesome. Okay. Uh, quick, quick. What the? F Can I maybe? I forget where the shot. Well, I haven't run into a shot. That's my problem. Okay, so I guess I'll hold on to my spares for now. Exit the fuck out of this system. You arrive at a long range beacon, the FTL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sec sector. The air shows signs of, the, of battle some time ago. There are scattered remains of ships, but one station appears to be intact. Examine the station, approach cautiously, but you detect no danger of use to have been a small rest stop that was abandoned a while ago. You take what few supplies you can. Awesome, we got some places. Let's fucking jump. Jump to the next sector. Mantis controlled and mantis controlled. So this goes mantis to mantis. This goes mantis to unidentified. No, ma mantis to mantis are identified. Uh, civilian sector. So I'm going do 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 Let's go dad away, see what we finds. You've entered a poorly charted area of space that is known to be home to the Mantis. Ensure your whole plating is up to scratch and that you have enough fuel in the tank to make it through. Well, yeah, that's kind of hard because I can't find any shops. I can't fix the damn thing. I can't refuel. There's a distress beacon. We're going for it. The distress signal is coming from a small space station orbiting an uninhabited planet. Their satellite defense system has gone haywire, and the repair crew can't approach it without being fired on. They're looking to, for help to fix or disable it. Promise to help. Don't actually, just promise. You consider your options. Split fire the defense system for the defense. Well, yeah. Ow. Five damage. You fire a few volleys, but aren't able to penetrate the defense system. Shields the weapons have no trouble piercing yours, so as you take armor damage before escaping the station, we find help else. Well, that was fucking brilliant. Didn't do shit. Just took damage. Waste of time. Brilliant. Fill it with oxygen, sis. Come on. Got to be some way to fill it with oxygen, sis. 
Why take so long to generate oxygen for a small ass room? Okay. It's another fucking distress beacon over here. Really? Alright, we're going for the other distress beacon. You find the source of distress call. A small research station appears to be a small laboratory. Fire got out of control and is threatening to destroy the station. Their fire suppression system is not responding. Help put out the fire. Doc to rescue the survivors. I don't got much crew and they're not very good. Okay, Doc. Well, pull alongside the station, cut through the hole. You are able to rescue a few survivors, but many more are lost. One of the survivors offers to join your crew as you offload the rest on a nearby station. We got Jones. Awesome. Jones, what are you? He's a mantis. Okay, you got no skills. But, we got a mantis on the crew. I have no idea if having more people on the weapon system is going to help it at all. At least, with as low end as it is. Are we are able to jump. Need a fucking shot! By the time you notice the rebel ship behind the beacon, it's too late to avoid a fight. Okay. Take out their fucking... Ow. Jones, can you do something about fixing that? The enemy ship appears to be powering Wizard of the Elders trying to escape, yet yeah, we're working on getting out the fucking. Go to help Jones. Oh, okay, he can't. Okay. Well, so much for that. Ah. Uh, why don't they fucking ever just say, okay, that's enough, we're gonna. We're gonna be. We defer to. Yeah, we're gonna. That's fine, we have no need to prolong this conflict. We will surrender and give you our shit. I'm like, no, you, you're gonna have to use up all your fucking missiles, and we're gonna do as much damage to you as possible, and we're gonna blow up and give you less stuff that way, because fuck our lives, we just wanna make your game hard. When where's a fucking shop? I got 72 scrap, but there's not much point in upgrading my, my fucking things when I need to upgrade my systems to get the things to work. And I desperately need to fix this hull and get some fucking fuel. <sighs> okay. Cody, get your ass back on that. Jones, you're on the shields. Actually, Jones, you're gonna help me pilot. Evasion increases that way. Oh, a store! Jesus! Uncertain about what you'll discover at this beacon, you scan the surroundings, you detect several warnings on wide band channels discouraging any violence in protected trade space. Perhaps you can find some wares nearby. Ah. Fix the whole fucking hole. Cost 34. Ah. Oh. Drone control, 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 mind control, and Defense come. Defense drone. Shoots down incoming missiles, asteroids, and flak debris. Requires drone parts to deploy. Powerful drone that attacks enemy ship. I can't afford any of that shit anyway. It's a whole thing about fucking. Fuck. Oh well. Well, I didn't have any of those. I had three missiles, they cost a fucking lot. Well, uh, thanks. Was, was really helpful, but fuck. Fifty percent evasion. Let's go with that. Well,
Mand evasion plus five. Okay, so. It says auto 50% evasion. It says evade 20% of the act. Oh, uh, well. Fuck it. Working on trying to improve my chances of living. And you're like, meh. Your world all of a sudden changes. The Mantis are on board your ship. Well, yeah. Oh, you mean uh, the, the, the bad ones. Oh, okay. So, uh, how about... Motherfuckers. Could they maybe... Die? Trying to fucking kill him by choking him to death. They're not doing it. Motherfucking mantis! You know! Jesus Christ, how fucking little air do you bastards need? Okay, let's wait for the fucking oxygen to get back up. Fucking Cody and Conspired are dead. Well, this is great. Well, Jones. Just you and me now. Where the fuck did... God damn, what's this game just fuck you right now? Seriously. Hey Jones, what's it like? Can you breathe yet? Sorta? Good enough? Fucking pull out all the oxygen, they don't care. They just fucking tear through everything and fucking kill us. Fucking brilliant. This is just not a not a good fucking day to be a goddamn pilot in space, especially if your name's the conspired one or Cody. Especially, it's not 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 good. Very sorry about that, conspired and Cody. I thought I could choke these bastards to death if they couldn't breathe. Evidently, that didn't fucking work. There's just three of them jump you, and you're just like, well. So, I'm gonna pilot this son of a bitch. Jones, you're gonna be back on weapons. And that's the best we can fucking do. Jeez. Get the fuck out of here. We arrived at long range beacon with ATL drivers, so you can jump to the next sector. Do you stumble across a rental ship that's distributing supplies to local civilians? It's probably not anything military grade, but every little bit helps. We didn't steal the supplies from the civilians. Cargo was booby trapped. That's just great. I'm just trying to fucking make a living here. You can't fucking fault me at this stage of the game for going for the stealing from civilians angle. I'm a bit fucked up. And you're like, oh, you get punishment for that. Well, that's exactly why I was fucking feeling it, because you keep fucking me up.
Jump to the next sector. God damn. Go into the uncharted nebula. -la -la. Nebubula. And Nebula must have been an important hub at one point, place and all his jump beacons would be no easy task. However, now it's hardly navigable. Inside a Nebula, the sensors do not function, but the Rebel fleet will advance more slowly to town. Okay. We got no fucking fuel. Ah, light flicker, light three, Rebel Scout bursts out of the wreckage. Hey, he's got cloak and shit. Jesus! I fucked my goddamn weapons. Motherfucker! Yeah, this whole dodging thing isn't working. Oh, great, 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 uh... Not a substantial a substantial collection of useful scrap material. Oh fuck. Fire, fire everywhere. Okay, we gotta fix fucking everything again there's no air in here oh shit that's what Jones fix the air in fact let's hurry up and fix the air Oxygen getting dangerously low all over the sh Okay, good. We fixed the goddamn oxygen. Let's go get ourselves back up to health. Fix the rest of this fucking ship. Goddamn trash can in space. fucking being so hard. Just, just shower me with fucking parts and happy crew members. Don't fucking kill my people and then just take my shit away. This is annoying. Oh, we only got four fucking hit points. the engines increases dodge chance. Manning reduces charge time on the fucking weapons, but it's like it only needs one, I think. Manning increases shield, recharges speed. Right, uh... I just fucked. I just fucked. Let's go. See if we survive this star. Uh, probably won't. Black market trader, uh, weapons trader spins you a tale of dangers that have been reported. Uh, push these where Unknown weapon for 45 scrap. Can't afford it. So just ignore. 
Let's just get the fuck out of here. Rock Harbor Transport nearby looks to have lost its bearings, but when you hail the group, show suspicious of whatever life form you are, we find you repugnant. We seek no aid. Leave now. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Can't see anything through the thick gases surrounding the ship without knowing what is out there. You all you can do is wait for FDL to charge. There's a store. Well, that's a chance to fucking fix shit up or get some gas. The center of the hydrogen cloud doesn't seem to be a very usual place for a store, but the NG aren't usual a usual species. It wouldn't hurt to take a look. Okay. Fifty-two to fix all. Can't fucking do that. <sighs> Clone Bay. Oh man. That'd have been so nice to have. We could have still had conspired with Cody. <sighs> Alright, it's the best we could do. Only got two Artemis lasers left. Long range beacon's almost hidden with an ambulance within the field drive. You can jump to the next sector. Okay, let's do that. Get the fuck out of here. Go, civilian sector. Dear God. Welcome to a new sector. Get to the exit beacon and jump to the next sector before the pursuing rebels catch you. But yeah, that's how it works. Makes it very easy to decide where to go. Well, that's great. The beacon has been placed too close to a super giant class M star. The ship will gradually overheat until you get out of here, or die. A pirate, apparently oblivious to the danger of the sun, moves in to engage. They would. Hey, let's let's fucking charge. It. Oh, do I fucking need to be in the pilot seat to charge the FTL drive? That's great. That's fun. I didn't know. I figured get to the engines, charge the FTL drive at the engines. Well, great, great. I'm just trying to get the fuck out of here. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. You get, get, you go heal yourself. This can do something. That... Motherfucker, we're dead. I didn't have enough fucking missiles to take you on anyway. Hey, that's FTL. Fucking terrible life. I just, I'm not a good spaceship pilot. Conspired's dead. Cody's dead. Jones is dead. And I'm dead. We're dead. So, uh, yeah. You know, maybe next time they can not send us through the bad part of space to get this fucking mission across. But that's just, just, just my idea. But anyway, until next time.